Hello, and you are now tuned in to the only universe mode that matters. I am Christian. I'm Jesse. And here we are, the final go home show to one of our final pay per views, Jesse, of this game. This feels crazy. Yeah, finally, man. I'm looking forward to never playing this game again. And hopefully, 2K22 is the greatest wrestling game. Oh, well, Jesse, you're going to be mad at this announcement. Season 3 will be happening. Oof. No, not, not with me. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Season 3, guys, will be dropping on... No? No. Nothing, Justin? That's dead in the water. He's not in it for the fans like I am. <laughs> I would do it. No, I wouldn't. I'm gonna, I can't even lie. Uh, guys, we're kicking this show off with a must-win match. These ladies right here, BWA, Marina Shafir, specifically, and Justin Duke, are my final two competitors in the women's Jesse Road Tag Team Tournament. Mm -hmm. uh, Fireflies, they, they they disappointed me. Yeah, they flew into the fire and got burned. Got burned. Yeah. For sure. Um, Dope entrance. Damn, I got a free sign out with them. I only got one thing in mind. Um, oh, damn. That's what I should have done. I shouldn't have done a men's battle royale today. I should have done a women's. Mm. Wow, I'm so selfish and I'm so... Uh, sexist, and I didn't even think about the woman. Damn it, Jesse. I'll, I'll probably do one in spite of that. There you go. Please. Please. <laughs> I'll probably do one in spite of that now. Yeah. Next please, time we please, record. Please. We have to. We have to. I feel, now I feel like crap, because I got, I got plenty of great women. Honestly, it's just due to the fact that I keep staring at my men's Royal Rumble roster, because I already picked them out. Um, me and Jesse already had the conversation. We already locked our picks in. Um... But for the woman, I, I don't have 15 options, truthfully. Mm -hmm. I can tell you Ronda Rousey's going to be there. I can tell you Shayna Baszler, who we haven't seen in Survivor Series. I don't know if she's been speaking to Ronda, but she has confirmed with me that she will be at Royal Rumble. Mm. I don't know where's the support as of late. I, at, at first, I thought she might have just been hurt because she was the sole survivor. She was the last one remaining in the Survivor Series match. She, she was getting like three on one or four on one. Something mm -hmm. crazy. <coughs> um, three on one, I believe, because we're short in that match. But, uh, yeah. I don't, I don't know what's going on with that, but it seems like BWA is still a cohesive unit as far as these three women. And they're gonna need a win, man. Yeah. And remember, these are Shayna, Shayna's girls. Mm -hmm. I mean, may, maybe she introduced her to Ronda, but these are Shayna's girls. And uh, obviously, all Ultimate Fighter contestants, right? Mm -hmm. Besides, obviously, Ronda. Yeah. Well, she was the coach. So Ronda does have a rapport with them, but as far as. It's the difference between having a rapport and being a friend of somebody. That's very true. So. Yeah, because we haven't seen Shayna since Survivor Series, like you said, and she was obviously the lone survivor. Uh, she, I think Beck Lynch was the one that uh, took her arm off at the, the end sequence there to that match. So, yeah. Honestly, I feel like BWA as a whole hasn't really had a lot of success since then leading up to Survivor Series because that was such a high-key matchup. It was obviously the four horsewomen of WWE versus the four horsewomen of uh, MMA from their past. And it has been working out since. BWA has only really gotten this one victory in this uh, Dusty Road Classic tournament since then. And Iconics, I feel like upsetting one of the favorites early on in the women's Dusty Road Classic, beating Raquel and Raquel Gonzalez and Dakota Kai. Definitely. So can Iconics, a team that has experience, has had the titles before, not in this universe mode, but in general, have had the titles, have won at a, a big WrestleMania stage, and these girls are really good together, and I don't know why they split them up in real life, because I feel like they were a perfect tag team, and the reason why they made the t women's tag team championships in general were for the Iconics. But hey, everything changes in WWE, well, nothing let's stays. If, let's see if you can do them right, Let's Jesse, or if I can... If I can... Run. This would be big. I need to win this, because the tournament, this tournament is a, is a shorter one. So I could still at least have... <laughs> My woman's make it to the finals in reality. Yeah, that's, that's what very, it would be. Yeah, that's very true. Because if you can have uh, Marina and Jessamyn Duke be your only squad that goes to the finals and goes to WrestleMania matters. and win the championships, one, you win another tournament, and two, you have uh, two women being your women's tag team. Oh my god! Women's tag team champions for uh, the next game. 
I would I would assume Jessamine Duke and Marina Shafir are in the game next year. I'm I don't sure. know. I didn't though. think about them. I don't know though. Cause what they're doing with Roderick Strong now, uh, apparently there's a storyline where he resigned from NXT and obviously uh, Marina Shafir is his wife. So I don't know if they both went together or that's I, I don't know yeah, what they put. They're not gonna that. go that in depth. Yeah. But we will see. And wow, well, universe line. Nice. But yeah, man. It's it's gonna be interesting for sure. If uh, BWA can take the advantage here of Iconics and kind of get that Ooh. first round upset, like kind of in the past, and BWA show that they're here to stay. Well, they okay. well they destroyed Kyrie Sane and Naomi. Oh yeah, and they destroyed uh, Kansas Lorraine and Asuka a few weeks ago when oh, hopefully uh, Ronda do doesn't get them disqualified. That would be a shame. What a way to get eliminated from a tournament, huh? By Ronda Rousey. Somehow that tags. Wow. Okay. Oh, this thing. God. And they're looking great to kick it off today, Jesse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these uh, these two created superstars are a very tough bunch to beat, I feel. Yeah, I'm not kidding. Billy K doesn't fly. Call me up, though. Why would I fake a punch in that moment? Oh, nice. Ooh. Oh my arm god. Drag there. Arm drag, that was arm more than, more launch. Than dragged, yeah. Come on, Billy. Man, if if I could win this match and honestly lose the rest of your raw matches, I'm I'm fine because that means I definitely win a tournament. Might not be me controlling the team or them winning at WrestleMania, but one of those ladies from SmackDown will win the tournament and have those tag team championships at the end of the, the season. Because Lita and Trish are on my roster too. Mm -hmm. So I will be carrying those women tag team championships into the next game, hopefully. If everything goes well today. In this match. And big words. Ooh. Okay. <clears throat> Man, I really wonder why they put Carmella and Billy Kay as a tag team. That's a tag team? It, well, yeah, they wrestled that WrestleMania together. So I thought Carmella was doing the whole bodyguard thing. Uh, they got rid of that real quick. That, that, yeah. was, that, was, that guy that, that was, was with that Carmella. Rumble. Yeah, that guy that's with Carmella is with Shayna and Nia Jax now. Really? Yeah. It's weird. What the hell? Yeah, bro. WWE just be doing stuff out that's, of their that's, out of their hat. That's fickle. They just be doing random things, man. Honestly, though, I feel like... Oh, Ooh, my gosh. The women's tag team division is kind of hard to, I feel like, book. They do a great job in NXT because they have really good wrestlers that could work together well as a tag team. But, like, Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler, I feel like they shouldn't be a tag team. But it's ended up working because they're doing why good should, work, I guess. they be a tag team? I think Shayna Baszler should be a solo kind of girl, personally. Because we, we've seen what she's done in NXT. Yeah, but not everybody can. F they, it's not like they have a universal championship, I mean, an uh, intercontinental championship, and a United States championship mm -hmm. for a woman. Yeah, they just got they, two titles. They, they got to stay busy all year round. They can't always be in the main event scene. Yeah, I, I just feel like the women's tag team division is very. It's not booked right. Even their men's they, tag they team have division. No, they have no excuse for that, though. Uh, yeah. It's not. It's not hard to yeah, book. Def they yeah, have definitely. no excuse. They have five hours of TV a week. Yeah. Exactly. It's just, I don't understand <clears throat> how they're not prevailing on a better opportunity to book the women's tag team division. Because honestly, bro, I can't even... I don't even think the men's tag team division in, in real life is even that good. Like, you have New Day, you got the Usos, but Jimmy Uso is, is injured right now. You got AJ, you got Street Profits. The Viking Raiders is back. Okay, cool. But, like, what do they do with the, the, the tag team division that is so special? You know? Because I feel like when we were younger... The tag team division was crazy. No, it wasn't. You don't think so? No. I thought it was better. Name, than... name, name multiple tag teams. No, no, and, and... I mean, not talent. I feel like they just booked maybe certain storylines a little better. No, not even. Well, they had Raider RKO, Degeneration okay, X. Okay, okay, that's fine. Legacy, Evolution. You, you see, you're just ready there, you're jumping generations. Yeah. If, that, if, you, if you're true. jumping generations, that's a different argument. Like, in the Ruthless Aggression era, you had DX, Rated RKO. I... 
Um, I'll say Legacy because that, you can't do that. That's two tag teams. That's two tag teams containing the same people. Oh yeah, that's right. Well, I'll, that was never around at the same time. Well, I'll, I'll, I'm saying, I'll consider... I'm saying, at the at the at the same <clears throat> moment, a tag tag team division is only so much. Is only a, it's only a few teams deep. Um, when you had DX as, as in your tag team scene, who else were tag teams at that very moment? Uh, Rated RKO. Um, I know Spirit Squad was just like a jobber kind of thing at that time. Uh. Back then, they used to do a lot of, uh, like, John Cena, Shawn Michaels, but that was only to hype no, up see, WrestleMania. See, that's a lie. That, yeah. The, uh, DX was a tag team. You're already confusing your timelines. They don't, they, you don't really, you never really have multiple marquee tag teams at the same time. Yeah. I feel like now, though, they have so much tag team division talent, but they just don't book it right. Really. Because, like, other than New Day and that, that, that's a different the story. Usos. I, I'm saying they have just as much talent as they did back then. It's, it's, it's yeah. It, it all comes down to the, it all comes down to the booking. I don't know. The, just as a kid, I, I feel like they built the tag team division maybe a little bit differently, but they definitely have more talent in the tag team division now. Like when Brian Kendrick and Paul London were tag team partners, they were going up against Deuce and Domino. They were going up against Trevor Murdoch and Lance Cades of the world. Like, it was <clears throat> legit all mid carters Yeah, I feel that. There was that one rare era where they would they would put the Shawn Michaels, the Triple H's, the Randy Orton, the Edges in tag team scenes. Mm-hmm. But that that was really it. Before, yeah. before then, it was it was mid carters occupying that scene. Then you get you get the Hardys here and there. Mm. You'll get um, oh yeah, the Hardys. You'll get uh, well, Matt Hardy left at one point in time, so you'll get Nitro and um, Mercury. Morrison, Nitro well, and Mercury, Mercury when they, when they were Melina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Another armbar. Mm. Yeah, I, I get what you're saying. It's just they they have so many writers, man, and Vince McMahon is that. Uh, guy that's been with the business for so long there's five hours of tv a week they have no excuse for it yeah and see in nxt though man like i i I feel like they really care about the tag team division i i feel like they care about women's wrestling more maybe it's just preference with triple h i I don't know it's my preference i just want the match one two tag team tag team wow i didn't kick out Tag team that that's crazy. All I care about is who's the baddest woman alive. And I destroyed you. Was that Payne Royce? I don't think so. Yes. Well, if that was Payne Royce, she was really hurt, and I couldn't reverse anything you were you were throwing at me. I don't know if that was Payne Royce at the end, but if it was, then yeah, there's uh, no yeah, way. Yeah, no, it was Billy Kane. Yeah, Billy Kane. Wow. That sucks. And BWA makes it to the finals. They'll be going up against either Hug and Boss Connection mm-hmm. or uh, Riot, Riot Squad. Squad? Yep. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we only did an eight, eight team tournament, right? Well, yeah. my confidence is a little higher now. I still wish I had the Fireflies win. I still wish Mindy Rose and Nia would have won, but it is what it is, and it ain't what it ain't. And uh, BWA is the team to fear. They, they, probably looked the most dominant in this whole tournament. So yeah, they looked really good in that match. Um, Cause, surprised it ended cause that soon. Because Hug and Boss Connection didn't look great. Neither did our Riot Squad. They mm-hmm. got lucky both times. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, we might see a rematch between BWA and Hug and Boss Connection. Because it happened on Survivor Series. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Okay. Just obviously minus uh, Becky and Charlotte. Cause and Shayna and Roman. Yeah, so we can see that rematch before uh, WrestleMania, because the winners of this tournament will go against Lita and Trish Stratus at WrestleMania. And I told you, Jesse, Cage was getting out of the hospital. And he's back. He is a machine, man. Haven't seen him since the Fiend match that I don't know what it was. They thought plugging a machine into the machine would keep me out of the game and keep me out of this ring. But here I am. I don't recover like your average man. They told me three to five months. I told them three to five days. And I'm cleared. Today. 
I asked for a match with The Fiend because he had an X on my head. This time I got an X on his. He avoided me all pay-per-view. And then when I got my chance to put hands on him, <laughs> I slipped off of a truck. There's no more running. There's no more hiding. There's no more flickering of the lights. Bray Wyatt, I want you tonight. I don't want you at Mania. I don't want you at Rumble. I want you tonight. One on one. No holds barred. Let's fight. And I'm going to wait in this ring until you come out and I dare somebody to try to remove me. I'm going to stay here glued until you walk your silly ass out with the lights down, acting like you're possessed. You never seen a man possessed until you seen a machine possessed. And he's going to be waiting, Jesse. Will we see the fiend? I hope so. As long as we do. And Cage is waiting, Jesse. He's still inside the ring. He is waiting for the fiend. Uh, he got his brother. The B team. That's still a thing. Bo Dallas in this game. All right, Jesse. Um, Yikes. Am I seeing things? No, we're Bo leaving right now. This is Bo Dallas, Christian. This is uh, yeah, what I, I, I can't believe what I'm seeing. I uh, might have to be the title of this video. <laughs> the Bo Dallas. What the fuck? What is happening? Yo, didn't he have like a really uh, long reign in NXT? Yeah, yeah, I don't care about any of this right now. What is? <laughs> Wait, what does it say? Bo Beast? The Bo Beast? Is that what it says underneath this here? Okay, yeah, that's not fair, Christian. This is this is Bo Dallas we're dealing with the team. Okay. Did the match start? Can I hit you with a weapon? I Can think I it you? did start. Yeah, the ref is in there. So, what a generic look for Bo Dallas, too. I mean, I I gotta feel like in some sort of sense this is this is comforting for Cage because he gets to oh, oh my god because he gets to put a beating on somebody that's related to the fiend. related to the fiend. Maybe because yeah, he can't touch uh, Sister Abigail. Oh, and, okay. Bodas gonna fight back. I, I, I didn't think I'll expect that. I don't think this match is official, actually, because the ref would have started counting by now. Sure. Okay, Bodas Bo is all right. This is the first time we've ever even seen Bodas in the game. So, uh, if you guys are a fan of Bo oh Dallas, we're sorry, but uh, I am not. Cage, Cage, what are you doing? Another man? power bomb. It looks like here. No. Oh no. Oh no! Oh uh, my God! I, I wish they gave you the animation where you could throw him on the apron. I guess not, though, right? I, I, I could if I wanted to. The kid right there with the blonde hair is waving it off already. He's not the referee, though. Oh my goodness! This is crazy. Come on, Bo! I believe in you. Uh, not anymore, though. Uh, wait, nah, the match. Wait, wait, there, we're having a match. I thought the ref was here to be a mediator. Yeah, I thought he was gonna split it up at one point in time in the match. Oh, he shoved him off like nothing. Okay. I've never used Bo Dallas a day in my life, so I'm I don't think anybody to has, Jesse. To what he does. Oh, that was a nice little sense on there. Oh, yep, that's where I messed up. Yep. I'm gonna get uh, oh, taken gonna care of it. now. What the hell is this? Mm. I don't even think I've ever seen that move before. That's crazy. I use the kick up and... Happens to me all the time. Yeah, it's my time to, to suffer now. Oh, boy. What the hell? How'd I get stuck with Bo Dallas? Oh, I oh, love no. this move so much, man. The cage is getting... Middle rope suplex. That takes tremendous strength, man. Cage is destroying this guy, man. I mean, I would hope it's Bo Dallas. Ugh. I'm just glad Brian Cage is fully healthy 
from his. Uh, what does he look healthy? Uh, he looks perfectly fine. Even if he didn't look healthy, he looked the same as he did in his previous matchup against the Fiend. Cage up to the top rope. Oh, oh beautiful God. elbow drop there. Gosh. I think that's it. X Factor? No, that's not. That's oh, not it, another Justin. powerbomb. No, 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 no. That's not it. Never mind. Oh, my God. Cage is like... Cage. <laughs> I was going to say Cage is like a man possessed, but oh that's what he said he is, goodness. Jesse. And I'm in red damage already. He said he is a man possessed, mm. and so far, that's the only answer Bo Dallas has had. Yeah, that one little uh, mat return right there. That's... That's... Oh, oh man, right gosh. into the LED pole. <clears throat> no. What the hell? Oh, oh my god. I thought he was going to throw his face into the the pole there. I believe. Yeah, believe this. X Factor. Correct? Believe that. Not X Factor, uh Drill Claw. Drill Claw. I'm thinking of Madden. Oh! Oh, the Fiend yes. is not going to like that. I mean, the I keep saying the Fiend. Cage is not going to like that. I thought it was not even that close to the ropes. Bogus call there from the referee, maybe. And now we're seeing Bo leave fight. I can't believe my eyes. He's fighting, Jesse. That's exactly what he's doing. I feel like the next big move hit on Bo Dallas is going to be wraps. But look at him go, Bo! We see No Way Jose defeat Aleister Black. We can see anything in this universe mode, Jesse. That's very true. Maybe it's the maybe it's Bray Wyatt and Bo Dallas's body right now. We never know. The Fiend will play those uh, I, mind I games. I can't reverse anything, so. Oh, I can't reverse anything. You have a comeback already. Working on the knee here already. He's telling the machine to get up. I like the aid of uh, Bo Dallas coming to his brother's rescue, if you want to say. Nice super kick there by the... the Bo uh, Dallas stood up standing. Kid. Yeah, he didn't go down. Very interesting. Bo Dallas rolls out good IQ there from someone that, if you want to consider him a jobber now. Consider him now. He's, when was he not a jobber? Uh, honestly, I really liked him in that uh, Miz Taraj. And that's that. God. And Jesse. He is trying to kill this poor guy. And uh, that, that's it. Yeah. You got a resiliency? <laughs> <laughs> you think so? <laughs> oh, that's my ball God. Game. One, two, three. Bo Dallas! Cage cannot be content with Bo Dallas, Jesse. Yeah, no way. He, he, he just put his head into the canvas over and over, threw the poor guy over the ropes, threw him into the barricade, threw him on the apron. That was a destruction of a match from a destruction of a man. Oh, and Bo Dallas is getting up, and I don't think Cage likes that at all. Oh, man. Cage is literally oh bringing God. out all the moves on Bray Wyatt's brother here tonight. Oh, my God. What the hell is this? F5? Oh, my God. Sort of, yeah. Here, yeah, this isn't cool, Brian. Or Cage. Brian. What is he doing? No. What is he? Jesse. Oh, my God. Jesse! That's, Jesse! That's crazy. Literally just... Picked him up from the ground. Did you, did you just see what the, the ref said to call and get some help? Maybe he's calling for Bray Wyatt's help, but he's definitely going to need it. Oh, Some my paramedics, because his neck might be broken right there. He the just bench-pressed Bo Dallas and threw him over the top rope. And he's calling for the Fiend. Ah, oh, man. What a 
what events, a turn of events we have had today. Uh, Bo Dallas making an entrance for The Fiend, I guess. Whatever the hell that was. Um, speaking of entrances, guys, I'm going to have to skip a lot of these because, like I said, I do have another Battle Royale. I am in the Royal Rumble spirit. And, um, yeah, I, I couldn't. I know you guys are going to say he's in the Unspeeded Attire. I'll, here, I'll, I'll do you a favor. I'll skip it. Because, uh, oh, yeah. It's, it's eight men. <clears throat> I'm not risking it and doing glitch, um, creative tires, and then me and Jesse are moving in slow motion for the whole match. Sure. So, bear with me. If all these attires are going to be the OG attires, so we have to do that. We're going to have to do that for the Rumble, too. You got to play this game the way the game wants to be played and not how you want to play the game. But, uh, this is a big match for all eight competitors. As you guys may know, Jesse has the final SmackDown slot. He earned that at Survivor Series, but... I have both of them. I have the 29th spot. And with that being said, whoever wins this match will be the 29th spot. That is big. Mm -hmm. That That's as close to guaranteeing a Royal Rumble win as possible. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, it's... it's a lot of it is the luck of the draw. This is eliminating the luck out of that equation. Will it be Drew McIntyre? Will it be Roderick Strong? Both of those two gentlemen, Drew McIntyre, uh, I'm sure he definitely wants to get a win on his belt. Mm -hmm. uh, he needs it. Roderick Strong, a guy who's... He's, 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 he needs it. He feels like a 500 fighter at this point. Yeah, he only had like two wins, bro. He, no, he's a 500 fighter. I don't think he said that many before. I think he's a 500 fighter for sure. Um... He's probably like a, a, a <laughs> if we're comparing it to like NBA teams, he's like probably a, a, a Dallas Mavericks. Hmm. You know, Braun Strowman this year, more like a Phoenix Suns maybe. Uh, maybe not for this year. Maybe he maybe he's a Denver Nuggets, Braun Strowman. But um, it's gonna be interesting to see what goes down at Royal Rumble. But I really want to know what goes down today as we have the person that I don't know if you want them to to be too late in the rumble because they are a threat. Matt Riddle can be a threat if you give him a late spot because the guy is just clever. Mm -hmm. He's elusive. He's clever. He's quick. I don't think he'll do good in the long term. But he might be able to string a good five minutes, and that five minutes could win you the match. That was very true. That's that's a Matt Riddle thing of him to do. He remember he was your first Money in the Bank champion. Yeah, my, the, he was your Money in the Bank briefcase, and he won the championship. He's not good for the long run. Yeah, he cashed in on the Fiend too. Yeah, he did. A lot of people forget that. He did. <coughs> but uh, didn't work out for him. But oh yeah, won. guys, if you guys obviously don't know, all these people will be in the Rumble regardless. Ricochet, you remember what what happened when he was in the Rumble last time? Yeah. I think he might have been 29th last time. He was 30. He was 30? On the dot? Mm -hmm. And what happened, Jesse? Hey, main events of one of the WrestleManias. Lost to Aleister Black. But uh, he was Cruiserweight Champion then. He was the King of the Ring. He was the Royal Rumble winner, but he didn't prevail and win at WrestleMania, which would have been significant because he probably could have won Superstar of the Year. But I'm going to be Black, honest, Jesse. If, if I was to keep my NBA comparisons, Ricochet might be the Lakers. Sure, everything we just did was regular season. We're about to reach the playoffs. Mm -hmm. And when it comes to the playoffs, you don't want to see the Lakers. When it comes to the playoffs, I don't think you want to see Ricochet. Yeah, I guess. If, if you told me Ricochet was going up against uh, Balor in the main event of Mania, are you confident Balor's winning? No. Exactly. But that that's a crazy match to see, though. Exactly. I kind of want to see it now. Uh, well, you might be able to get it. Are you Ricochet? No, I'm not. Oh, oh, yeah. I know. Yeah. I Damn, not. I, why didn't I, I'm not good with Ricochet. That's the thing. I'm, I'm all right. But, uh, <coughs> Pete Dunn. Bruce Come on, man. We could keep on going. These are high. These are heavy hitters. These are heavy hitters. Pete Dunn versus Finn Balor was a classic in NXT recently. We see it in our universe well, as It well. might be Gargano too, Jess. You, you don't know. I don't, I'm not mm -hmm. confident it's Finn Balor. Oh, Gargano I am not confident that it's going to be Pallet, truthfully. I think it will be. It could also, you know, 29th entrant, 
I feel like we're, we're just going down a long list of names, Jesse. But on that list of names, you gotta have some legends on there. And if you have a legend... Oh, wait. Um, I thought it was the next person. But, uh, nevertheless... No, no, this is the right person. Uh, 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 we can yeah, no. play with the music. Yeah, you gotta have some legends. Somebody who's powerful enough to freeze your, your screen behind you. Yeah, right. And, oh, okay. And then put it back. Cause when you name, oh, well, what was he actually? He was in the. He, was, he almost survived last year, right? Uh, yeah. He was last three. I think so. I believe. Yeah. He I got the it, chance to do it again this I think year. The last three was RVD, Morrison, and Ricochet. Yeah, and he had I the remember. chance to do it this year. Hmm. I can't wait. I'm I'm, I'm surprised uh, you put him in this match. To be honest, RVD. RVD. Yeah. <clears throat> he's uh, challenged for the Intercontinental Championship this season. He's had a, a few good matches. Had a, I think he wrestled Finn Balor at one point. Obviously, Tommaso and a few other guys. But uh, I had really... Going into the draft last year, I had really good ideas for him. But when it came down to the nitty-gritty, I was like, damn. I don't know what I could do with RVD. <laughs> when it comes down so. to the nitty-gritty, Jesse, I don't know what else I could do with Aleister Black. Yeah, if he doesn't want to rumble, bro, I, I feel like his, he's uh, done. He's not on Mania. That, yeah. That's without a doubt. He and he would have. It, it'll hurt my heart, but I, I couldn't put him on Mania. Mm -hmm. But I'll do you one better, Jesse. If he doesn't win tonight, I wanted to do a gauntlet match. This is the closest thing I could do. Mm. If he doesn't win tonight, Alistair Black would be the number one entry. At the rumble. At the rumble, he should have. He should have beat. Mojo, uh, <coughs> what was No Way Jose? He should have lost. He should have beat No Way Jose. That was a great moment. All right, all right, all right, Definitely the biggest upset of all time. Without a doubt. Yeah, upset of the year, unquestionable. He might have destroyed the career of Aleister Black. And honestly, bro, <coughs> I feel like his career was. Destroyed if Aleister before, Black is not in the next game, not destroyed. If Aleister Black is not in the next game, and the last memory I have of him is him losing to No Way Jose. It's possible. It's very possible. It is very possible. So with that being said, I'm going to have to redeem Alistair Black. It, it'll really be a shame if he's not in the game, bro. Oh, and beautiful cutter. Yeah, on. and by the way, guys, this goes crazy. People are going to get eliminated in the first few minutes. Yeah, just It like could be Alistair Western. Black. It's going to be very Who hard to Who are you, Jess? I'm um, Roger Trump. It's going to be very hard to get Braun out of here, but Pete Dunne is trying to do it. Yeah. Ricochet on Drew. Big German suplex there. RVD landed on me. I love how this match is perfectly smooth, but a Survivor Series tag team match is just... It struggles beyond belief. It's just it's not even doable. Hey, yo, bro. Chill. <laughs> I thought he was almost going to... And we got some good matchups I like here. Uh, We've seen Braun Strowman, Roddy before. We've seen... Uh, well, we haven't seen Ricky and Drew, but I would love to see that. Oh, and I just want Black to... and Riddle, I would love to see. Pete and RVD, I would love to see. We got some great matchups uh, that can be teased tonight. Riddle, oh my god, Rob Van Dam and Black. Hmm. That would be a fun match. I'm on a strong. Oh, wow. Oh, nice backbreaker. On SmackDown, on the, I mean, the, your last Monday, uh, Monday Night Raw ba Battle Royale, I feel like three people are already eliminated by this time. Well, Jesse, these are these are main <coughs> events. Well, I mean, the last one was main eventers, too, so I guess that's no excuse. Yeah, oh. Last one was champions, and I and I guess that's the difference. Some some champions are just too damn strong. Roderick Strong oh. taking Beautiful. the arm of Ricochet there. Uh, yeah, I can't. Guys, I'm going to be honest. I can't commentate on what's happening in the match except to what's Ooh. happening with Black and RVD. It's enough things I can focus on. I got to focus on not being eliminated. And oh, our, there and goes Riddle, Riddle. Riddle has been eliminated from the Battle Royale. And there goes Ricky. No, no, not even bothering. And there goes me! <laughs> Yo, I just eliminated Ricochet and I had my back turn too long, I guess. Oh, and I just hit an... I just put you in the negative. Leave me alone, RVD. Leave me alone. Oh, wow. I can't believe that, bro. I got eliminated when my back was turned. There goes Pete Dunne. You ready for him? There goes Drew McIntyre. Oh, jeez. And when they fall, 
They come tumbling down. RVD in the remaining three once again. Oh, Never mind. Good luck. If you just throw him out, that'd be crazy. I know. I'm not doing that. And Br Alistair Black is going to have to go through Braun Strowman. If not, his career might be done. We never saw Braun versus Black, right? Oh, wow. I'm no. so dropped here. It's gonna be interesting here. And our reverses. That might be it. Yeah, it is. How do I do it? That's it. Let's go! That was the fastest battle royale <laughs> of all time. Oh, Jesse and Alistair Black. You eliminated three people, I think. Through the fire. Hmm. I eliminated Drew. I eliminated Braun. I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh, man. Okay. So, our 29th entrance in the Royal Rumble is Alistair Black. That is scary as shit. Yeah. I need it off. He's back on his A game, though. What we see the Black we saw tonight. I, bro, if I showed you, remind me. If I play the tapes and showed you the, the move I hit Drew McIntyre with that I reversed out of, mm -hmm. he had me in an electric chair. And I hit the I hit I got him in the the second reversal. And I hmm. put him in the negative. I don't even I didn't I don't know how I'm even catching these things right now. I'm in a good rhythm. Can Alistair Black find a good rhythm and somehow win the Royal Rumble? I don't know. I have no idea. We'll find out though. At Royal Rumble. As far as tonight's show, Je uh, Jesse, we only got one more match left, and it's a championship match. And now for the main event of the evening. I think I might have just jinxed it, Jesse. I said it's going by quick. This match, this match right here could last forever. Uh, yeah, I feel like the first match was very long between these guys, right? Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was a pretty good match that night. It was a great match. I mean, I, oh my, I mean, look at who we're seeing without their titles. This looks weird. Yeah, Trent and, uh, well, especially Tyler Bate. I feel like he always has a title. He had a title on him pretty much all of 2K19 Universe. 2K20, he was United States Champion, Tag Team Champion. The the, the guy has literally... He's a world title away from being a Grand Slam, Grand Slam Champion. Think about it. In the game, right? Crazy. That's crazy. Well, yeah, actually, he would have to get another mid card title. But no, I'll, no. I'll consider he, the Cruiserweight Championship uh, another. He's had mid card. He had United States. Yeah, but don't you, as a Grand Slam no. champion, don't you have to get both? You just need a mid card, tag team. Do you need? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I think you might. Yeah. So, so he'll need the. I'll consider the Cruiserweight another Almost. title, though. Almost. It's damn near. The guy has been impressive. Um, yeah, Trent Seven has had a breakout year, though. This yeah, season, very though. true. This has been the season of Seven. Um, to the point where I don't know who's the better one. But th these two guys are brothers. And yeah, they're, not, they're, they're the mustache it, boys. It, 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 it doesn't matter. The mustache mountain. It doesn't matter who's the better one. If it equates to dollar signs and it equates to wins, that's all that matters. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know what we'll see out of this team if they don't win today, Jesse. I mean, the season's close to end. We only got three more weeks of action. It is sucks, this, man. It's, whoever it, wins this is your champions for next year? Possibly. Yeah, possibly. I don't see when these guys are going to defend the titles again. How many matches we agreed to for Mania? 14, was it? I think 12. 12, we said? Oh, uh, yeah. I, I think 12 might be right. I think yeah. we did four, four... We'll do four episodes. <clears throat> three apiece. Yeah, four times three and 12, yeah. Well, I mean, we'll, 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 when we start drawing up the card, we'll see how many we're at and see. What As of right add. now, I have five. Um, I believe I got to do the math of mine. I only got a few permanent ones, but Royal Rumble is gonna be. As soon as Royal Rumble ends, I'm gonna have a bunch locked in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think my Mania card is already locked in. Truthfully, no matter what happens at Rumble, I think my. Mania has no effect of what can That's happen. That's a lie. Oh, yeah, I'm lying. That's a yeah, lie. Yeah, because anyone could win the Rumble. Anyone could win the SmackDown. Yeah. Uh, I mean, not the SmackDown. Uh, the Women's Royal Rumble, too. So, yeah. So, yeah. Next time we record, we'll be doing um, Rumble. And uh, we'll have to figure out what happens then. Yeah. Uh, 
It's going to be interesting, man. <clears throat> we are going to have a classic tag team championship match today. Lucha Bros with one loss under their record, and that's to Velveteen Dream and Cody Rhodes. Mm -hmm. Honestly, maybe that's who they go up against if they, they win here today. Mm. Maybe that's their last defense. Maybe. Get who beat you and make sure you prove who's the better team. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that sounds like a pretty good match. So, we will see about that, Jesse. Today... Lucha Bros just want to walk out with those titles. They're not looking towards the future. And Mustache Mountain, you think they want to be left off of Mania? Definitely not. They worked 11 months out of the 12-month span so far. And they want to make sure that they get their rewards in the last month. What? Okay, we're focused on our partners. Good to know. And Tyler Bate with the first exchange here. And I completely... Oh my God. Phoenix and Tyler Bate. I would love to see these two wrestle in real life. Oh, yeah, in real life. Yeah, I was going to say it happened in this universe. <clears throat> Obviously. And now your controller's about to die, Jesse. Yeah. Ironically, we... Whoa. I swear, bro. The, the more we play this game, the more glitchy it is. Well, good start here by uh, Lucha Bros. Oh. oh, damn. I don't know how you got I just got out of the way a little bit. Yeah, these guys are just too flippy for me. For me to even uh, get out the way. I love Lucha Bros. The matches I've seen in uh, Lucha Underground and in AEW. It's just, they're just way too athletic for me to even reverse anything. Like, look at that. Even that was athletic. What was that? I didn't even know I reversed it. Okay. Very odd way to, not really odd way, because Christian just reverses everything. And. Is this going to happen at WrestleMania 2, bro? I don't know, bro. <laughs> or in Rumble? I don't know. What the hell is this? What is this? What is this? This is a, this is a regular move? My God. Oh, oh my God. Cool. Oh, I think that was that was uh, Joe's and <clears throat> Balor's finisher. Because that was a muscle buster into a coup de grace. Oh, wow. Pretty cool. That's amazing. I didn't <laughs> even know that move was in the game. Neither did I. Trent. Okay. Uh, Lucha Bros had their Wheaties. There, never mind. Trent to the rescue. Never mind. Back and forth, man. Never mind. Start off. Yeah, never mind. Working on the arm there of Trent. That was an incredible move. There we go. I got something. Okay, Todd gets up there. Can I get these tag team titles back on the mountain of the mustaches? Jesse, if, if we were uh, a tag team, we could be Mustache Mountain. Um, I guess. Would, would you want to be called the Beard Boys instead? No. No? Probably, uh, maybe, eh, not David and Goliath. Uh, that's a good question. What could be our, our, our tag team name? Hmm. Might have to come back to me. I could actually oh. probably try and think of a name. Like a nice, clean name for you and I. Okay, Ray Phoenix is different, bro. What is this? No, it's you! Hmm. <laughs> You're different, Jesse. Have some more so. faith. I, I thought I had that. You're different if you hit that again. I thought I had that. I was confident. If you would have hit that, I probably would have turned heel during our tag team run. <laughs> Based off you know they do, they want us to make 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 eh, make ourselves in the next game. Yeah, I saw that. Well, I, I've been they've, seeing been, that they've been wanting us to make for it for some time now. Since, for, since our first universe. Yeah. I, don't I think know, I don't we know if that's do what that. Do, I think no. Nah, I've I've seen it, I've seen it in the universe one. I think like I should be Braun, and then may, you should just pick someone that kind of looks like you. Maybe a uh, Connor Reeves. Kona Reeves. Don't ever disrespect me like that again, <laughs> Jesse. Honestly, that was fighting words. We're done. We're done as a tag team. But uh, we broke up. Rick, yeah, Ricochet would kind of be cool. Ricochet versus Braun Strowman is actually would be a really cool match. I think we saw. Out. I think we saw it. Yeah, we did. Oh, well, what could happen again? Yeah, awesome. Next year, book it. Man, Oh. Oh my God! What if I landed on my feet? I would have cried. <laughs> I don't doubt anything anymore, bro. Cause I I reversed like the Oscar. Butt thing and it's, it's yeah, just, it's uh, it's the things you shouldn't reverse. I love how I just didn't 
hit. You cleared both of us. Hit oh, damn. Thing. I was still I was still focused on it. That was my fault. I don't know if it works on us. I guess not, huh? <clears throat> oh, wow. I have three of them, but I didn't reverse any of those then. <clears throat> Whoa. Yeah, hit, hit your brother, please. Damn it! I want to throw him in the ring. No, I'll clear the count just in case. Six. Yeah, plenty of time. That's insane. That was slight. I did this on the regular. I remember, oh I, my god, bro! I remember the first time I did that, you lost your mind. <laughs> yeah, I think it was with Ricochet. It probably was, and we were like, we were like treating Ricochet like he was like the one. In, I mean, that's the ironically one his only, name. Yeah. But he was the one and only that season. That was the special season. Yeah, it's kind of crazy how, like, the way we build other superstars that you would probably consider stars in this universe mode but aren't stars in WWE. We turned Aleister Black into a superstar. We Ricochet. Turned, while also, look at, look, at, look at how cool this is. Roman Reigns still was strong. Seth Rollins still stood strong. Um... We didn't probably do John Cena any justice, but John Cena's barely here. Um, yeah, that's very true. Same thing with Brock. Uh, I'm trying to think of other people we made stars. Gargano. Gargano. We Joe elevated. for the run la uh, two seasons ago. Yeah. Um, Tommaso had a really good season this year. Oh, yeah. Tommaso had a great season this year. Uh, Tyler I Bate. I made Sister Abigail a star. That's true. I kind of... Eh... Would I say I made Rhea Ripley a star? Because she just became she, a thing she now. She herself a star. Yeah. But that, that we still, we I still made kept... R Randy Orton relevant again. Oh, uh, sure. I feel. Uh, the Asuka, I still love my Asuka, Ky Kyrie saying. Yeah, all three that. of those girls I consider stars in our universe. I just do. Oh, my God. This is about to be a star-making move. What the hell is this? Right on his neck. Oh, my God. That's very dangerous. Stay dangerous, Jesse. Stay dangerous. Just watching. But yeah, I definitely consider uh, some of these guys in our universe stars that aren't stars in the current product. Oh, damn. I was hoping to do it while you were on your... Tell me that would have been dope. Yeah. Oh, goodness, bro. Which is obviously always a good thing, because if we can elevate stars in a game, what then... What the hell is he doing? We could oh, use that man. talent for when the next game comes out, you know? Penta uses comeback beautifully there, I gotta admit. Mm -hmm. Damn, I was hoping you wouldn't have Yeah, <laughs> let me pick. Okay, tell you. Whoa. I perfectly oh, wow. weaved that and then I caught something else. Hit him, Tyler! Jeez! And Penta's eliminating people left and right from the Royal Rumble. Is he gonna be there? Possibly. You never know who you see. I just want your foot, bro. Why'd I, why'd I do that? Of course, you reverse it, because you reverse everything. Oh, man, why did I do that to him? Oh, look, you reverse everything. Oh, look. Oh, my God, man. How did, how did I miss that? I don't know. Can I hit? Thank you. I don't know what's going on right now. Come on. Crazy match. Yes, Just like sir. the first. Oh my god. I don't how know. How do people do that? Yeah. Yeah, bro. When I see that, like, I don't understand how, as a, like, a regular human being, you don't respect that. No? Like, you're you're literally putting your entire life on the line at that, at that moment. Oh, that is a clean reversal. Tell the driver. If you... Oh, no. How many times have I done that? No! Bro, literally. Uh oh. Use your kill. Oh, you don't have a kill. I don't. Okay. Yeah. Damn it. I'll take it easy on you. I was literally. I'm going for the pin. You have to be kidding me, bro. Oh, right in front of Pentagon. One. 
to... Holy crap, I lost my marbles. Yeah, I'm stuck. Oh man, that might have been bad. No. No. Okay. Oh my god, these tag teams are going crazy. Ah! That's it. Come on. Let's go. No way, bro. Oh, and he shoved the ref. What an idiot, Tyler. No way. I accidentally was targeting the ref and shoved them. I mean, it wouldn't have mattered because. Oh, boy. I'm just going to try to hear hmm. really God. Wow. That was a missed opportunity. Like, very, very mixed opportunity right there, man. Oh, beautiful. <clears throat> my finisher. Alright, why is my mom doing a comeback? Okay, I, do, I didn't see them. I can't. It's no corner. Maybe. Oh, oh my god, and I eliminated you from the Royal Rumble. You know what? I'm let him die. Not really, but oh. the saying is to just let him on. Myself there in that aspect. Oh my goodness, man. I'm focused on the wrong Lucha bro. There we go. Oh my goodness. What the hell is this? I don't know. But you oh. fought out of it. I did? That's what I do now. No way. Oh my god. You just got whacked in the face, buddy. You're in the negative, and I didn't hit you in the finisher. That is absolutely crazy, bro. That just blew my mind. Oh, man. Everything is working in the Lucha Bros' favor. Will the win work in their favor? Mm. Okay. Both of these guys have great... Why am I focused on Pentagon? If I was just wrestling with Phoenix. Mm. I'm just gonna cancel it. No, no. One. Two. Holy crap. Holy crap. Oops. How does that not hit you? That's big time. That's big time. Put him in the coffin. Put him in a coffin. One, two, that's it. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! How does that not Put hit him, in him a coffin. bro? Like, it's literally not physically possible that I missed that. You didn't miss it, Jesse. I reversed it. Did you really? Yes! I don't I it looked like you didn't even move though. I, it looks like it legit just didn't con contact him at all. I reversed the da damn Move. I feel like I won two matches this whole time. I yeah, and you've been here for three shows. Congratulations. Go home and do better. The Lucha Bros. I got they did it. Say. They did it. I got nothing to say. Jesse, I got something to say. At Royal Rumble, that was just one rematch. We got two other ones. Well three other ones at Royal Rumble two for Monday Night Raw and that is Champa trying to get his title back from Samoa Joe that's the Intercontinental Championship and that will be in a 30 minute Iron Man match we also have Finn Balor trying to reclaim I'm sorry trying to defend his title against Johnny Gargano we've seen him beat him one time can he do it two times we'll find out at Royal Rumble along with the two Rumble matches and these Petty Smackdown matches what are they again uh, we got Bloodline versus Street Profits for the Tag Team Championships. 
probably the last time uh, Bloodline defends those titles, uh, or if True Profits take them. We'll probably have to see the rematch before WrestleMania. Don't know if it'll be at WrestleMania. I might have to open up a slot. I don't know. We'll see, because I'm pretty set in stone what I want to be at WrestleMania for, excuse me, the SmackDown matches. We're going to also see Rhea Ripley get her rematch against Bayley for the SmackDown Women's Championship, and obviously we're going to be seeing the two matches from Raw, and then the Royal Rumble matches. So, I can't wait, guys. Next time uh, we record, we'll be doing Royal Rumble, and then officially we'll be uh, done with the game very, very soon. So, t stay tuned, guys. The end of the season is on its way. It is on its way, Jesse. Until then, though, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Ring the bells, get our new updated videos. Maybe Christian will stop reversing uh, the double reversal moves, and I could actually win some matches. In other words, like Christian said, Stay tuned. We'll and, see uh, you on. We'll see you on. The other side of the universe. Peace. No rush, I'll take my time Just a crush, girl, fall in line Don't care what the rumor be Cause I'm my best, she only lie If this ever ruin me, I pray I die with dollar signs I feel like I'm Kobe Bean I'm 21 and in my prime